Hey guys, this is Night Night one and I'm talking about Philip. Yes, I'm talking about Philip again. It feels like every time you think, oh, the Philip story is done, no, something else is brought up. And what was brought up this time? Well, I was watching Yong Ye's video, I hope I said his YouTube channel right, and, where and he's talking about how IGN now has to completely basically get rid of almost all the articles that they had that Philip wrote. Now, why are they doing this? Well, remember when Philip made his whole non-apology video, right? And how he was all, you know, I dare you basically to find anything else that is copyrighted and whatnot, right? Well, people took that dare pretty seriously and they found other things. The recent one, I think, was the one that Yong Ye pointed out that he copied like a Neil Gaff article when he was doing his Joy-Con review or something like that. If you found out one thing was contaminated, sometimes you can go, okay, we'll just throw away that one thing. But if you start to find two or three, and you don't know which ones are contaminated, you gotta basically throw out all the stuff. And that's what IGN is doing. They're basically throwing out most of his articles until they can figure out which ones are legit and which ones may have gotten copyrights from. And it just sucks, this whole thing, because now IGN, look at all the work IGN has to do here. I just feel like now IGN, when they, come to have like job openings and stuff they're not going to trust any small youtuber anymore and kind of all because of what philip did and philip really doesn't have anyone to blame but himself because here's the thing all philip i believe had to do was get in front of the camera say guys i'm sorry for everything basically and move on and but philip had to go and dig his dole deeper just like what mom my mom used to tell me which was like, stop while you're behind, not stop while you're ahead. See, Philip should have stopped while he was behind. It's like he was done 10 feet under, and he's like, okay, might as well keep digging. No, yeah, that's what he did, because he dared people, he dared Kotaku, like, hey, if you could find anything, come on, come find something. And what happened? They found something. I mean, really, I, it's just, you, he dug his own grave, basically, with that statement, so... It's just one of those things, you can't, like I said, Philip got no one to blame for this but himself. He messed up, and then people started to realize this ain't his first time doing it, and now what happened? It just, it's all sad, like I said, because this doesn't just affect Philip. IGN has to do all this work now, taking his articles down, going over the ones to see which ones may have plagiarism and which ones don't. I just don't see them, or maybe even any other big major like gaming news corporation trusting small YouTubers anymore. I just think a lot of them be like, okay, yeah, we're done. We're done. We're not trusting any more small YouTubers. We're going to be going with just people who like, I don't know, are in journalism or stuff like that from now on. I just see that possibly happening all because of what happened with Phil over here. That's just me. I just feel like the ramifications of what happened here are going to go on for years to come. And who knows what else will be dug up, but hopefully this is the last time I'm talking about this. Hopefully, Philip, I agree with Yong Ye. If you watch this video, you just gotta come out, just admit everything you did wrong, say you're sorry, and get on with your life. And then you may have a 1% chance. I'm gonna go with a 1% chance, not in the gaming, but at a YouTube career. You're, you still got subscribers, so, whatever, I'm just saying, you may have a 1% chance if you come and do that. If you don't do that, you're done. You're done. You're done. You're done with gaming, you're done with YouTube, you're done with everything, okay? Other, uh, so, um, I think it was Review Tech USA who said you better hope McDonald's is hiring. Anyway, what do you guys think about all this? And let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, remember, like, subscribe, and may God bless you all.